good morning. This morning got a whole lot more exciting. I have some things to catch you up on, but not a lot of time. So I'm gonna make this quick. There's no internet here. It is about 3.30 in the morning. Luckily, there was someone downstairs who doesn't work here, as in not for the hostel, but he does, does repair, so he does know the owner. He woke the owner up and I was like, I'm so sorry, but like your Wi-Fi is out. I don't have data. I'm not gonna walk around the streets of Rio at 3.30 in the morning trying to find a taxi. He's like, help me out here. And he's like, okay, I can order you an Uber. He was not too happy about that, but I can understand that. So he's gonna order me an Uber and then I'm gonna head to the airport. Sao Paulo International Airport. Let's go to Iguazu. Welcome to Iguazu. For once I didn't mind the middle seat because I was next to the window, but I preferred a window seat, but I didn't get that. I saw Iguazu from the sky. So it is the next day and I've been not that great at filming anything. Don't look the best, but all right. I think one thing that I didn't mention yesterday when I was doing all the flights, I barely filmed anything or at least not as much as I could have, but I felt like an absolute, like I felt absolutely horrible. The thing is the day before when I ended the video, I said that I wasn't feeling too great just after i'd finished that video i started feeling worse and worse until i eventually you know spend the evening in the bathroom throwing up i think it's food poisoning so yesterday i woke up at four no i woke up at like 2 30 ish i don't know if i mentioned this but yesterday but the wi-fi was out so i had to, like long story short i had to wake the owner or like the hostel receptionist be like look there's no wi-fi i don't have any data i need to get an uber to the airport he ordered an uber for me got to the airport i decided to take like rehydration and like electrolytes like tablet thing and then i i was i was not good i was not doing too good i was weak tired nauseous felt horrible felt sick so i got on the first flight because i thought about not doing the flight and taking the like missing this flight and doing um a flight the next day but that was gonna be 288 euros i was like i'm not doing that so i went on the flight horrible then i had a layover in sao paulo where i had to switch um, from one airport to the other so I got an uber and I tried not to but I like dozed off in the uber and then I went on the other flight which was horrible not, not the flight I felt horrible and then I mean we did get a beautiful view over Iguazu like Iguazu Falls which was very very cool and then I got here and crashed pretty much I spent some time talking to some people here because I finally meeting other backpackers. I don't know what I did wrong in like Rio and Ilha Grande, but backpacking vibes were not there, or at least not where I was. So I didn't eat like all of yesterday. I drank, I think maybe 400 milliliters yesterday. So that is not enough. I'm trying to do better today, 
but the nausea is still there. I'm still not doing too good. Initially, the plan was to go to Iguazu Falls Brazil site today and then eventually go into Paraguay and do Ciudad del Este, which I know I'm not saying correctly, but we're going with it. And then to Encarnacion, Encarnacion, I don't know. Once again, just going with the pronunciation here. Um, to go to the ruins, but I think I'm going to have to make a choice because I already booked my flight from Iguazu, Argentinian side, um, elsewhere. So I have like I have a, a a deadline here, but about the flight, like my flight got cancelled. I just got an email. So luckily, I, they could put me on this like the same route, but two hours later, which is fine. I would say that's not. I would I would say that's not a cancelled flight, but a rescheduled flight. But fine. Luckily, I could do that. And I think I'm keeping my window seat because I paid two euros for a window seat, which I usually don't do. But I think I think I'm on the right side. Like, well, I'm on the left side of the plane, but like I'm on the right side to see Iguazu from the sky again, which I would happily pay two euros for. So yeah, that's a little update. Nothing from today, but I'll see you tomorrow.